In Alaska, veteran river paddlers Seaver Barouche and Mike O'Brien are on a mission to conquer every river in North America. With minimal supplies and water too full of silt to fish in, Seaver and Mike must beach the boat and hunt to feed themselves. I'm thinking this right bank here. All right, you got this gravel bar coming up. He's moving a lot quicker here to our left. You're coming hot. You're coming real hot. You're too hot right now. But a quick survey of the riverbank reminds them that they won't be hunting alone. Look at the size of that thing, dude. Holy <laughs> I've never seen anything quite like this in fresh water. Look at the size of this beast. It's obviously a king. Holy Wow. Well, hopefully we're eating that well. Yeah. It's salmon season on the Copper River, and that brings in hungry grizzlies. We got right. some decent-sized bear tracks all over here, so. Oh, yeah. See the claw marks here. That's not that old. It's been raining heavily here. It's got a two-inch claw there coming off. I wouldn't want to bum rush it out of that bush anytime soon. Bear scat. Oh, look at that. This bear scat doesn't look much more than a day old. It's pretty fresh. Fresh diet of berries. Do you think they were just passing through, or they got a den somewhere on the island here? You know, I'd be real leery of walking much further in there right now. But we only got three days of ration, so see if we can't scare up some birds, but keep your head in a swivel. Yeah. The plan is to head toward the brush, hoping to spook Alaskan sport birds like grouse and ptarmigan. But the bird shot they brought to hunt with won't do much to repel a bear charge, which is why Seaver will stand guard for him with his large caliber pistol. Glad I'm packing, because they're big bears out here. Oh, we're trying to get in some ptarmigan and some grouse. A lot of work for a little meat, but we only have three days worth of provisions. You need to take what you can get. But every step toward the brush that lines the riverbank warns them of possible ambush. We're definitely in the heart of the bear right now. Let's just let them know we're here. Hey, bear! Woo! Right, I just hear a few birds, which would be nice. A near-perfect ambush predator, an adult male grizzly can reach speeds of 30 miles an hour and crush a bowling ball in its jaws. Mm -hmm. Hunting birds will require stealth, but quiet isn't a luxury they can afford in bear country, where many attacks occur by startling a protective sow with cubs. Hey, man. In the dense Alaskan bush, announcing your presence might save your life. Here we go. What do we have here? What are you seeing? Right there. Yeah, there's markings everywhere on these trees over here. Wow. Look how deep these claws go on here. All the way up and down. Yeah, this is where the bears clean their claws on these trees. Also a way to mark their territory, so. We are in it. We're in it. It's a danger. This is too close for comfort. Yeah. It's not. Did you hear that? You hear that moving around? Not well, sure. I'll hold it. Quiet. Yeah, it's real close. Bear, 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 bear! Go, go, go! Get moving. Can you see that? Fire warning shot. Holy Damn. Fire warning shot off. 